A day after a record trading session, U.S. stocks were lower Tuesday afternoon amid weak U.S. auto sales and a continued stabilization in oil prices. U.S. stocks closed at records on Monday with the Nasdaq above 5,000 for the first time since March of 2000. Today, lack of economic data has shifted attention to earnings as Best Buy earned an adjusted $1.48 per share for its latest quarter, beating the estimates by 13 cents, though revenue was slightly below the forecast. And the exporting goods earned an adjusted $1.30 per share for its latest quarter, 8 cents above the estimates, with revenue also above the forecasts. In a quick market recap, the Dow Jones traded at 18,224 points, about 65 points down or 0.38%, led by Boeing, Caterpillar and Intel. The S&P 500 traded at 2,107 points, about 10 points down or 0.46%, with telecommunications leading the gains, and the Nasdaq opened at 4,978 points, about 29 points down or 0.53%. Meanwhile, in the forex market, the U.S. dollar is holding stay as the euro dollar is 0.01% higher at the dollar 1184. And trading center analysts are focused on the U.S. dollar Swiss franc pair, which is facing a pullback but stands above the new support at 0.9555. So as long as 0.9555 holds as a support, we look for further rise to 0.9630 and 0.9670 in extension. Crude oil futures rose about 0.14% to trade at $49.73 a barrel on the New York Mercantile Exchange, and gold futures were up nearly $5 or 0.4% at $1,213.80 an ounce. And don't forget, don't forget to keep checking the Blackwell Global website for more of these videos uploaded daily from the New York Stock Exchange. And for Blackwell Global from the New York Stock Exchange, I'm Hoda Osman.